it's a lot to take in, right? The gloves, the underhand serve, the foam ball. It's not quite like anything else you've ever played before. At the same time, there's a familiarity to it. It's not tennis, but it's similar. Inspired by the pre-1878 rules of tennis, which required players to serve underhand, this is forehand strike. By removing the overhand serve, which emphasizes speed and power, this new sport fosters attention, focus, and creativity, encouraging players to use both hands and to think outside the box for novel and unique ways to score points. To win, you simply earn enough points to close a set, just like tennis, and then enough sets to close a match. You could play one-on-one -on -one like you see in the background, or two-on-two -on, -two on an area officially 40 foot long by 20 foot wide. The ball is served diagonally, starting outside the left service area baseline, and points can be scored by either player. Forehand strike is played with either hand, using mostly a forehand technique motion to rally and win points. Backhanded shots are not allowed, and neither are volleys since the ball must bounce once before a player can return it. Additionally, forehand strike is a wonderful as a workout. Check out what this licensed physical therapist has to say about it. Hi, my name is Jake Yos. I'm a doctor of physical therapy. I received my training at the University of Virginia and the Medical College of Virginia. When I first heard about forehand strike, I was skeptical. And that's my job as a clinician, to be skeptical. But once I watched the sport, and once I played it, a few things came to light. Research shows that people who exercise are more likely to stick with it if that exercise is game-based. But most ball sports are injurious because of contact injuries and repetitive unnatural movement. But unlike those other ball sports, forehand strike is primarily underhand, which allows movement mechanics in a way that actually improve the health of your shoulder joints. This allows you to have fun while you get in shape and improve the overall health of your joints. It's low impact, no contact cardio. Now, I don't know what the future holds for forehand strike, but I can tell you two things. I'm going to be watching and I'm going to be playing. The only pieces of equipment you need are an official size net, an official forehand strike foam ball with the correct size and density, official pair of customized gloves that creates friction with the ball to control the direction and spin, a nice piece of chalk or tape to create a boundary line, and a copy of the official rules for anyone who hasn't played before. From your niece to your grandfather and everyone in between, the whole family is going to adore forehand strike for its simplicity, the same way the serious athletes will for its cardio workout and mental challenge. Check out what Jennifer Salinas, a former women's boxing champion, has to say about it. Hola, hola, soy la reina boliviana Jennifer Salinas, ex two-time world boxing professional champion. So I know about the sport, I've been in it for 20 years. And I can honestly say that forehand strike does come in handy when it comes to preparing somebody to be a boxer or even do the conditioning boxing. It, it's great. I actually like it. He showed it to me once. I'm looking forward to the second session. Forehand strike. I wish you the best. Terrell Green, do your thing, man. Jennifer Salina, peace. After two years of the development, all the forehand strike components are fully prototyped. They work, and we are ready to launch this game. But to do that, we could use your support. Read on below to see how you can get involved and become one of the first to own an official forehand strike set. Thank you.